My name is Nassine Sabs. Why is God going to punish certain people worshiping the devil when the New World Order Antichrist Satanic government takes control over all of the nations over the world? Why? Because of what is going to happen. You understand what I'm saying? When this happens, and it will happen, okay? When this happens, it's going to be the most horrific, terrible thing to ever be in this world, okay? It is going to be the height of the most wickedness that is going to befall onto the earth, okay? It is going to be so evil. It is going to be so evil, and it's going to be called good. And it's going to be called nice, and it's going to be called. And if you're you're against, and if you're against it, then you're going to say people are going to call you bigoted for being against the evil. You don't want to go with the evil. Well, then you're bad. You're a bad person for not wanting to do evil, and for not accepting evil. That makes you bad. So everything is going to be turned upside down. Okay. Only fools and people that love their own death will. Try to bring about the new world order to exist in this world, because the only reason for a new world order to exist is to kill you, is to kill people. Okay, it is to kill people. That is what the point of it is. The point of it is to kill. The point of it is to kill. It is not for any other thing. It doesn't. It's not for anything else. Okay? The whole point of everything that the devil tries to do is to kill as many people as possible. That's it. And so the devil already understands that if he can trick idiots into worshiping him and following him by telling these idiots that they're going to get goodies and nice good things, then he'll just say that. He'll just say that. And if the devil believes that he can get a person to get destroyed by giving them something, then he'll just give the person whatever it is so that the person be can become destroyed from it. The devil doesn't love anyone or care about anyone. The devil doesn't want to give his followers anything. He's only doing it so that he can trick them into destroying themselves. That's it. That's what it's for. It's not for world peace and love and security and everyone singing kumbaya around the campfire and every, all nice times and there's no more, there's not going to be any more wars and there's not going to be any more anything and everything is going to be nice and good and it's going to be perfect utopia in the world and we're going to have perfect utopia in the world. Just have the New World Order in there and the New World Order is a peaceful world filled with peace and goodness and love and light and everything else. No. That's not what it is. It's only to kill people. That's it. And the satanic Luciferians, the ones that are literally killing babies every single day in service of Satan are the ones that are the most deceived about this topic because they think that if they just bring about the new world order then everything good will will happen to them in their lives when they don't understand that the devil hates them and the devil wants to kill them and the devil wants to kill these people and the devil doesn't love these people and the devil doesn't give a shit about these people. And the devil will never love anyone. He will never he will never care about anyone. He has hatred 
in himself for everything that has to do about God. And what is the most wonderful thing that God made that God loves above and beyond everything else? People. I'm not the one that decided for God to do that. God is the one that decided to be that way. And the devil didn't want to accept it and the devil didn't like it. And the devil thought God was making a mistake and that God was wrong about being like that. What is this all about? What is this all about? What is everything? What is it all about? It's about knowing who God is, loving him. That's it. What is the devil all about? Making sure you never find out who God is and then killing you. That's it. That's it. That's what this is. That's what all this is about. That's what all the evil you see, all the evil, all the evil that all the governments do, all the evil that you've ever done, all the evil that's ever been done to you. What's it coming from? It's coming from the devil. That's what it's coming from. It's coming from living in a world that was corrupted by fallen angels. That's what, it, that's what it's from. That's what it is. That's what this is. That's what all of this is about. All of it is about that. Howard, what a long and strange trip this has been. Here's to you. I'm honored, my friend. Here's Thank to you. you. And here's to hell. May we have as much fun there as we had getting there, huh, Howard? And we'll be there. <laughs>